we need to change 62 miles per hour to meters per second. Let's identify conversion factors that will help us to change miles to meters. We can use this one. One mile is equal to 1.609 kilometers. I know it's kilometers, it's not meters, but we can go from kilometers to meters because one kilometer is equal to a thousand meters. So first we will change miles to kilometers and then to meters. Very good. You will love it. Next, we will change hours to seconds. Write down what you have as a fraction. What do we have? We have 62 miles per one hour. So write it as a fraction over one hour and prepare to multiply. We are going to take this conversion factor one mile is equal to 1.609 kilometers and plug it in in such a way right here to get rid of miles and be left with kilometers. So prepare to multiply. We have miles on top in the numerator. So we will put miles in the denominator. So miles cancel out and we will put kilometers on top in the numerator so we will be left with kilometers and now let's plug in the numbers from the conversion factor one mile goes in the denominator and 1.609 will go in the numerator very good miles cancelled out and we are left with kilometers but we do not stop we need meters so prepare to multiply again we are going to take this conversion factor one kilometer is equal to a thousand meters and plug it in in such a way to get rid of kilometers right here in the numerator and be left with meters. We have kilometers on top, so we will put kilometers on the bottom so they cancel out and we will put meters on top. So kilometers canceled out and we will be left with meters. So we will put one kilometer in the denominator and a thousand meters in the numerator. Very good. So kilometers canceled out and we are left with meters. Very good. Next thing, we are going to change hours to seconds. So what conversion factors do we know? One hour is equal to 60 minutes. But we don't need minutes. We need seconds. One minute is equal to 60 seconds. Very good. So we are going to change hours to minutes and then to seconds. Very good. So we prepare to multiply. We are going to take this conversion factor. One hour is equal to 60 minutes and plug it in in such a way to get rid of hours. Our hours right here in the denominator, we want to get rid of them. So we will put hours in the numerator on top and we will put minutes on the bottom. So our hours cancel out and we are left with minutes. Now let's plug in the numbers. One hour goes here on top, 60 minutes will go on the bottom. So, but we have now meters per minute per minutes. We need seconds. So we will prepare to multiply by another conversion factor. And our last conversion factor, one minute is equal to 60 seconds. We have minutes in the denominator. So we will put minutes in the numerator, right? So they cancel out and we will put seconds in the denominator. Very good. So one minute goes here and 60 seconds goes in the denominator. Before we do the math, let's eyeball what we have. We have meters right here. Yes, meters per seconds. So we got exactly what we needed. Now let's do the math. So go back from the very beginning and pick up all the numbers we have. So draw the fraction bar. Basically, we are multiplying all these fractions together. Let's do it. So when you multiply fractions, what do you do? You multiply numbers in the numerator. Then you multiply the numbers in the denominator. So let's go. 62 times 1.609 times 1,000 times 1 times 1. So we will have meters in the numerator. And on the bottom in the denominator, we have 1 times 1 times 1 
times 60 times 60 and we will have seconds do things carefully so we don't make any mistakes very good so when we multiply the numbers in the numerator we will get 99,758 meters over when we multiply the numbers in the denominator we will have 3600 seconds now we divide the numerator by the denominator 99,758 divided by 3600 we will get 27.7105555 meters per second but let's round to the nearest tens so when we round to the nearest tens we look at the digit to the right the digit to the right is one it is less than five so we can round it to 27.7 meters per second very good i love it so 62 miles per hour is approximately 27.7 meters per second very good i hope this is helpful but if you get frustrated with conversions do not give up just take a break and come back and try again you are tremendously loved by god for God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. I am leaving you with this awesome news, and I will see you next time.